Hello everyone, today we will set up a consensus node and make the update uh, that has been shared on Discord. Uh, if you have already uh, downloaded the Celestia app D, uh, you can just skip this part. We will just show the this update and the, the Celestia app D, how you can set up it. Uh, let's go to Celestia and Centralized Testnet from our website. Uh, Control F. We will write 3003. So this is, as I said, uh, the consensus node uh, setup guide. Uh, if you have already have it, you can skip this part. We will enter to the terminal with SSH root and uh, write our password. Here, when you write your password, you can't see the letters, but you, you just write and enter, you will enter to the instant. Uh, if you have screen, you should enter to the screen with screen uh, dash R and enter. Now we are in the screen right now. Just copy and paste like me, like I am doing right now. Uh, like I said, if you have Celestia FD, you don't have to do these steps. You just skip this part and go to node, uh, light node update, please. Uh, there was some uh, friends who asked us that they couldn't create the Celestia FD, so we will show them how they could create it. And also we will add the snapshot for them. Uh, so, like I said, if you create it, please pass this part. Uh, let's see the Go version here. Okay, it's already installed. Copy this and paste it here. In here, you just need to copy and paste everything as our guide. The tutorial uh, the snapshot will take some time when we uh, download it we will change the but let me show you how you can change the moniker name uh, I will show you in the text file let's go a bit down scroll down and uh, here uh, the green maybe you cannot see you shouldn't use the double code I, I, I just write node 101 uh, now you can see it on the terminal, by the way. Uh, I will enter to Celestia app. Uh, if you do it here, it's better. So click enter. Uh, you should see this output. Uh, when you see this output, that means that uh, everything works properly. So let's keep going. Uh, you just need to copy and paste. That's all like this the persistent peers let's add it and set it in the config file uh, these are for the app tools you, you don't need to care about it just copy and paste it and uh, we should do this uh, you will see this output and uh, let's keep going on uh just i will you can do it in uh, the other page but not now i will uh, firstly download the snapshot and then we can change the the page with control a plus c uh, just please copy and paste like this like i am doing it uh, lastly we need to copy and paste this one uh, this will take some time, so I will show you, like, this, uh, it can take three hours, you need to come back and uh, check it later. Don't worry about the screen, it is very normal that you can see it like this, don't worry about it. Now, I will open another place, uh, just copy and paste this one and add this inside it. Control S, Control X to save it uh, and keep going like me, like I am doing it here. Uh, you 
will see this output. Uh, I will not write the restart and the journal because like I said we are uh, downloading the snapshot this one uh, sorry let me yeah this one let me show you uh, there is some time so don't care about the screen look when I play with the screen it's uh, changing but you should just follow here uh, don't worry about it when it's finished you will see it very properly so uh, light node update guide uh, here you can see the the one has been published on discord uh, you can follow our guide uh, if you have already have the celestia update you don't need to do anything from this just you can follow from here please follow our structure how we do it uh, as i said the the thing above is for celestia fd for the consensus if you have already have it you just start from here now we need to check the go version yeah and enter to the celestia node stop the full node stop the light node because we will update both of them okay now we will git fetch uh, just copy and paste, paste whatever we are doing here. Uh, uh, here I will write make build, but I will change the script for you, don't worry. And uh, you can do it like us. I will remake the sudo make install. Done. And keep going like this. Please do it as, as like we, we are doing it. You need to follow exactly like us because you have to init the initializing in here, in this file. Okay, this is done. Now let's look to the full node update guide. Uh, completely same. We will go to the full node file first and uh, delete the data uh, file and then we will initialize the full node again and now we can restart the full node in this screen and uh, we will go to the, the light node screen let me go with control a p uh, just control a p you can see that is already stopped. Control C to stop the log. And uh, just we need to restart the light node uh, from this command. Yeah, as you can see, light node also is working properly. So we are good to go. Uh, everything is done. I can show you now. Uh, here please please don't worry about this it's it's nothing when it's finished the screen will look very well uh, so let's start the the task the celestia uh, what what celestia knock tasks uh, yeah we can go to the celestia knock page you can see here that I have submitted some of tasks click here uh, let me show you the the full page uh, you can see it closer as you can see here the tasks are explained by the team you can see that I submitted these four tasks, not all of them right now, but I will do it as soon as possible. Let's go back. Here you can see that there is a instructions link. Uh, let's click on one of it and uh, see how it works. The, for example, let's do this one. 
as you can see, the team has uh, some description for us, uh, some direction. Uh, I will go directly to this link. You can see that they have prepared the command for us. I will just go to the terminal, control A, P, control C, and uh, paste the command here and uh, click on enter just a moment it will show us some output uh, yes now let's copy this output till here by the way you only should do it one time one time so i i will not send this task just i will show you how you can create this task uh, the submitting uh, pay for uh, let me check pay for blog transaction you can see it from here when you click here you you will see the command here you just copy it and go to the terminal and that's all so let's say I want to submit for this one I will go to the uh, submission place I will choose the bonus tasks because it's there and you can see that create a UI for submitting pay for blog transaction here I will click on it and just paste this when I click on submit which I will not right now uh, directly you will see that it is submitted so for example let's say this one how it works you can see the team has explained very well you have the node id here and the wallet address uh, if you don't remember how you can get your node id let me show you from our website uh, let me search if i could find it like this uh, let me scroll down it should be here something like yeah here uh, let's copy and paste it here and again we will copy and paste this one and the la latest one is this one when we paste this we will see the node id like this uh, you just copy it and go to the deploy bridge node uh, let me show you how you can uh, submit this task just let me delete this we will choose praise 2 because it's on the praise 2 deploy bridge node uh, as i said just one time we can submit i will not click on this but you can do it like that uh, you can see that i submitted so this is the node id and uh, yeah this is the wallet it will ask us both of them so you can do it very easily and uh, when i click here you can see that they they just ask us the matrix uh, like this the direction we have already add this one uh, to the node let me show you how you can see it uh, by the way we we actually did it for you it is uh, already when you restart like this with this command you can directly use it but let me show you how you can see that we have already added uh, here you can see that the matrix is uh, added uh, you don't need to add anything specifically you can see from here it's completely added to the node you just need to restart your node once a day you can see like this so you are good to go again and uh, there is the maintenance main team maintaining high node uptime sorry i couldn't say it uh here <coughs> sorry you just need to add your node id to the submission task which we we did uh we asked it to the team they said just you can add it so uh yeah i think this was all that i can show you i will do this the last for task uh, as soon as possible uh, th that was all I think uh, thank you for watching uh, you can check the update like with date 
you can see when you write the date like this you can see the all the updates we will also publish any update on our web page uh, yeah that was all thank you for watching and lastly lastly I want to show you like we are a validator that we are validating these chains if you have some tokens you are welcome to stake to us uh, this is not, not mandatory if you like to stake to node 101 validator uh, that would be appreciated uh, thank you so much for uh, watching have a nice day thank you so much